welcome back to another video so in today's video I'm going to be showing you my Briarfest haul so it's kind of been a while since Briarfest at this point it's September now and I got my horses I think mid-August so sorry it's coming so late but um yeah I've just been kind of lazy and been putting off this video and I was gonna do an unboxing video but when they got here, I just got back from vacation and my phone wasn't charged and I wasn't really going to wait for my phone to charge, so I didn't end up doing an unboxing video, but here's the haul. It's finally here. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So we're going to start with Dinesh's, no Dinesh's Northern Tempest. Um, I got two of them, so I took one out of box and left one in box. Um, I believe everyone's calling her Danny, but she's the celebration horse. And I just want to say I love the boxes. They did a really good job. They're so colorful and pretty. But yeah, I thought this one was interesting because its tail is kind of glossy, but the rest of the horse is matte. So I don't know if that happened with anyone else's, but um, that was a bit odd. And this one doesn't look like it has that glossy of a tail. But, yeah, we have the four event stable mates, and I ended up getting all four instead of doing the gambler's choice and getting a random pick of one of them because I thought they're all really pretty. So, I can't remember their names, like, I'm not even going to try. But we have the one that looks very pink on camera, but he's more of a rose gold. He's a little more gold in person, but he looks very pink on camera. And we have the little purple fjord, this guy, which I've noticed a lot of people don't like, but I think he's really cute. I don't mind the yellow. I think it looks cool at the teal. Um, and he's on the fighting stallion mode. This little guy who I think is adorable. I am in love with the mold. It's so, so cute. And, um, his markings are really beautiful and is a very shimmery, nice blue. It's very pretty. And we're just going to go up to my limited editions. And this is Kaleidoscope, the little stable mate for this year. Moving on, we have a Josie. She has a little bar vest on her belly. And she is Brindle on one side and Bay on the other. Um, and she's a cute little star. Next, we have Apollo. And he's very shimmery shimmery <laughs> um i believe they said his color was a double pearl and again the stamp he's very cool um i love the mold it's my first one on this mold and i love his little brand so that's him and then we have the best of briar fest set and all of these guys which I believe are shrunken down models from Firefest Fairy Tales. And they're all very cute and just gorgeous. I have to say, my favorite is either this one or this one. I just think the markings are so crisp and beautiful on this one. But that is him. I got into my special runs. As I said, I got two tickets, so I got four special runs. So here we have Uppington. He is. On the normal variation, for anyone who didn't know, they came in two different variations. Um, I was expecting to get the normal one because there's only 200 meet the other one. So, anyway, you know, I'm happy with him. I think he's gorgeous and he's very pearly and beautiful. So, yeah, I think he has really pretty eyes too. Um, this is Tassili, I think is how you pronounce his name. And I got him in his variation with the long mane and tail. And he is very pretty. He's so coppery and glossy and just, I love him. I would have liked either variation. I did like the other variation a lot. And I wasn't so sure about this variation when I first saw him online. But now I really love him. He just has a really sweet face. I had to go to the other side of my bed. But here is Senorette, I think that's how you pronounce his name, Senorette? 
I don't know. Um, close enough, but he has beautiful, beautiful dapples, which don't know if you can see. The lighting's a bit weird this way. I can like turn him around. I don't know, the light lighting looks a bit weird. But I was originally not sure whether I wanted this guy in glossy or matte, but after seeing the both variations, I'm so glad I got him in glossy because I think it makes his um, mean pop a bit more and just look, his color look a lot richer and yes, I really, really like him and I think he has the sweetest face and I think I'm going to start hunting down the other guy on this mold, the Premier Club horse, which I just blanked on his name, but yeah, I am going to start hunting down him because I love this guy so much. And here we have my seven art surprise and I got the um, Palomino paint Pintaloosa, is that what you call it? Palomino Pintaloosa. Um, let me just say she's gorgeous, but to just make it even better, I got, sorry, I just got it her, him in um, glossy, which there are only 325 made of this guy in glossy. So I was so excited to get him, especially since it's my first Briar Fest. And he's just gorgeous. And this was one of the colors I wanted the most. So I was really, really happy about that. And all the special ones have the tricolored eyes this year, but they were very beautiful. So yeah, he's very, very pretty. Last but not least, I got Prisma, which I just have the box here because Prisma is actually in a very safe spot because I didn't want to break him. So he's in a spot where he will not be broken because he's glass. I cannot be trusted with glass things. But yeah, that is my breakfast haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm so happy that I was able to get everything I've been saving for so long. And... I'm so happy with all my models. So yeah, um, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.